who's got no pants, no dignity, and a big fat search warrant? It's coup plotter Mr. I plead the fifth, Jeffrey Clark, of course. You traitor! Jeffrey Clark was the low-level Department of Justice lawyer who handled environmental issues, who never did a jury trial or ran any criminal investigations. Yet he, he prepared a memo on DOJ letterhead saying that the 2020 election was fraudulent and that states should overturn the will of the people and appoint Trump electors. Jeffrey Clark plotted with Trump and John Eastman and Rudy Giuliani, all of whom have received their search warrants already by the FBI, to become appointed as the acting head of the entire Department of Justice so he could use our Justice Department to illegally overturn the 2020 election. Let's play the video of the FBI. Hey, Mr. Clark. Yes. How are you? Good morning. Good morning. Anya yeah, Whitney, I'm a special agent with DOJ OIG. You can just turn that off for me. Um, can you step outside with me? We've got a search warrant and we need to um, speak to you today. Can I get you to step outside for me? Can I call my lawyer? Sure. Um, Come on outside. Yeah. Let's, uh, let's step outside. And we'll just real quick, we got to clear the house, make sure it's safe. Is your wife home? Uh, no, nobody's home. Okay, okay. so no one is in there? You can absolutely call your lawyer. Go ahead and step outside with me real quick. Okay. And then we'll put we you over here behind your car so no one will see yeah. you. Go ahead and step on out here. Come on me. this way. With, can I put pants on first? Sir, we got to clear the house. We're going to clear the house. Sure as soon as we clear the house, we'll get you to talk to your lawyer and we'll get some pants on, okay? Can I open the sir. garage and stand in the garage? It's a search warrant. It's a Step search warrant. Come on, right over here. Please. You can stand behind the cars and we'll see you. There's no reason. Can I put on my pants? Can I put on my pants? Can, can I? Can, shut up, you traitor! As a reminder, let me play the video of what Acting Deputy Attorney General Richard Donahue told the Jan 6 Committee about his interaction with Jeff Clark, who tried to become head of the DOJ so he could send the letter to the states overturning the election. Play the video. Environmental litigation and things like that. And I said, that's right, you're an environmental lawyer. How about you go back to your office and we'll call you when there's an oil spill? And uh, Pat Cipollone weighed in at one point, I remember saying, you know, that letter that this guy wants to send, that letter is a murder-suicide pact. It's going to damage everyone who touches it. And we should have nothing to do with that letter. I don't ever want to see that letter again. And so we went along those lines. I thought Jeff's proposal, Clark's proposal, was nuts. I mean, this guy said at a certain point, you know, listen, the best I can tell is the only thing you know about environmental and elections challenges is they both start with E. And based on your answer tonight, I'm not even certain you know that. The president said, suppose I do this, suppose I replace him, him, Jeff Rosen, with him, Jeff Clark. What do you do? And because the topic of today is clearly body cam footage of traitors, let's play the body cam footage of John Eastman, who a federal judge in California has said more likely than not engaged in conduct with Trump in leading a coup in search of legal theory. Play the clip. Can I see the warrant, please? I'd like to see the warrant. I'd like to see the warrant. I'd like to see the warrant. Can I see the warrant, sir? I'd like to see the warrant before you take my property. Sir, there's something wrong right now, sir. It's right over. Here, it's the warrant. All right. I want you to see that they took my property before providing me with the warrant. I'd like to read the warrant. Whiny, whiny coup plotters, whining that they're being inconvenienced with search warrants after they tried to overthrow our government. I'm looking forward to the day when I see both Jeff Clark and John Eastman being criminally charged and sent behind bars far away and for a long dang time. Hey, please make sure to subscribe right now to the Mice Touch YouTube channel for more breaking news. Thank you.